Hello from Slovenia again. Today I will do a reverse flower dip, but I will draw some puddles. <clears throat> draw. <laughs> I will make some puddles with my acrylic paints mixed with pouring medium. I have them in my squeeze bottles. This one is from Fluid Art Co. And I have a few little ones, and this is titanium white and extreme sheen. Uh, antique bronze, extreme sheen, copper, extreme sheen, gold, and then extreme sheen, sterling silver. And I already put down my black base coat, it's just oxide black Amsterdam mixed with my pouring medium. And I will teach these techniques on PourCon live this August in Las Vegas. So if you didn't check, how to register for PourCon, check the description box below. I will talk a little more about it in my Friday video. But this, I just want to kind of, no, I went totally too much to the outside. Let's do, I want to have it kind of symmetric also. I will just place my middle and I will start with puddles. As I said I will do some puddles and then I will use my napkin to create a flower. So I'm just putting down my puddles and I will add one extreme sheen paint and white in between. And I will just keep on going. Oops! <laughs> white. because I want some white lacing over this metallic colors because they will lace.
Okay, so my pattern is down. And now I will spray my paper napkin and do a reverse flower dip. That you will be able to learn on PoorCon in August in Vegas. So it will be so much fun. Check PoorCon. And now we can just hope that it will turn out nice. <laughs> Lift my corners. And other ones, the sides, or how can I say? Kind of, I don't know, think that I did this one a little weird. We will see. No, it's not weird. It's beautiful. Just add some paint on the corners where I scrape a little paint with my napkin. At this point you can spin it out, but I like it like it is with some negative space but if you would do this on the bigger canvas this is just 8 by 8 inch canvas you can spin it out but don't let the size of the canvas lead you to do a, I don't know too much layers or your flower pattern too big because you will not be able to Spin it out and keep some negative space then. Sorry, I have a cold, so my voice is not the best, but this flower is. <laughs> Let me take you down for a close up. So here it is the wet results. And don't forget all those colors are metallics and they will shine through. I kind of want to do one with the opposite layer with silver outside to towards the antique bronze in the middle. But love it, love it, love it. If you want to learn this with me, definitely have to come to PoorCon. 